Let's go, come on, come on, come on. Let's go. Come on, Brian, get a treat. Come on, get a treat, hurry up. Good girl. We do so much together that, you know, 44 years is a really long time and known each other for even way more than that. And so, you know, he reads me really well. <laughs> and I also read him very well. <laughs> this is Riley, and she's been a therapy dog for, since she's been a year and a half old. <laughs> <laughs> what may I do for you? I was diagnosed with MS, um, how many, 14 years ago. As it has progressed where I don't have a lot of stamina, I can't stand still for very long. Obviously, I don't make an issue of it. I walk with a cane all the time so that I don't fall down, and so I hold his hand. I might get tired, and then, I, you know, I say, he'll look at me, and he'll, I'll say, let's do a little more. We can do a little more. And sometimes that very last visit is the one that has just made you, oh, I'm so glad we went. Hey, Riley. All right, it's time to go to work. Let's go. She's on and she walks in the hospital or a nursing home or what have you. It's just, they just know it's time to do their thing. We have a dog that visits. Would you like her to come in? You have a puppy at home? Yeah. What do you got? I have a Jack Russell Shih Tzu. All righty, buddy. Come say hi. Riley likes basketball. And you know what? She likes to watch it. Don't you love it when the dogs come? There are times where it's, it's, it's emotionally draining where it's been a, maybe a tough day. It is, yeah, definitely a time where we just want to kick back, watch, watch sport, basketball or whatever. And doing it with these guys, it's really kind of a really special time.